How to import users from Active Directory to only Office. On your portal start page, click the Control Panel link and switch to the LDAP section. Click the Enable LDAP Authentication switcher. In the Server field, specify your Active Directory server IP address or DNS name. The default port 389 is used for a regular LDAP connection. To use a secure connection over SSL, check the Enable SSL box. The port number will change to 636 automatically. Check the Enable Start TLS box to secure the connection using the Start TLS technology. The port number will change to the default one. In the User DN field, specify the distinguished name of the directory you want to import users from. Set the login attribute value. Change the user filter value. The attribute mapping section allows you to set up a correspondence between the user data fields on the portal and the attributes in the Active Directory user record. Click the Add Attribute button, choose the necessary data field from the list, and specify the user attribute used in Active Directory. Click the Group Membership switcher if you want to add groups. In the Group DN field, specify the distinguished name of the directory you want to import groups from. Change the User Attribute value. Set the Group Filter value. Specify the Group Member Attribute value. Set up Admin Access Right Settings. Click this button. Select Full Access and specify the group that should have full administrative rights. Choose a portal module from the list and specify the group that should have administrative rights to the selected module. Turn on the Authentication switcher and enter the administrator credentials to access Active Directory. Click the Save button and confirm import. Wait while users and groups are imported. Now you can switch to the People module to check that the users and groups are imported. To adjust the synchronization options, turn on the Auto Sync switcher and set the necessary time to perform the automatic synchronization. You can synchronize data every hour at specified minutes, or every day at a specified time, as well as every week or month at a specified day and time. Click Save to apply the settings. It's also possible to synchronize data manually by clicking the Sync button.